What can I get you folks to start? I will not be ordering. I want to go home now. Come on, Bree. Calm down. Have a drink. I don't drink. Wasn't that in my file? Someone's slipping. Level with me, Bree. Do I still have a chance with you? None whatsoever. Then this can't make things any worse. That's right, keep driving, buddy. Why'd you do that? Get in, Violet. Oh, my God. You couldn't have dropped me off before you pick up a prostitute? You arresting me, Chuck? Just taking you to the women's shelter. So what is this, your good deed for the night? You trying to impress your date? No. Nope. That ship has sailed. She hates me more than you do. Why? What's wrong with her? Let's just say my opinion isn't any of your concern, miss. You're better off without her, Chuck. This one's got a stick up her ass. And what qualifies you to make such snap judgments about people you've just met? I'm a hooker. It's what I do. And I'm watching to make sure you go in. You know, I'm just gonna be back on that corner tomorrow. Yeah, well, that's tomorrow's problem. When are you gonna give up? What I am now, that's all I'm ever gonna be. You think so? Did you know that 10 years ago, Bree here was turning tricks just like you? How dare you? Bree? She needs to hear this. I must have hauled her ass in 50 times. Then one day she said, I'm better than this. She got herself to school. Before you knew it, she had a first class catering company. So don't try to tell me that you can't make a better life for yourself. You were really on the street? Actually, I. I don't like to talk about that part of my life. I get it. Look at you now, huh? It was really nice to meet you. Likewise. Thank you, Chuck. Don't mention it. I know, way out of line. He said I had no chance, so I figured, what the hell? Home? Yes, please. 